Oswald lives! You fight well, Heathen. Thank you for heeding me, Eivor. I know the worth of such a gesture. All this is... is like a dream. But you are not asleep. Well fought! Well fought! The both of you! You came as well, old friend. If I'd known you were still alive, I would have stayed in Norwich. Look around you. A happy occasion and a glorious victory. And soon, something more grand to take place. A wedding, my love. If you will still have me, that is. And why would I not? I fought poorly. I melted under the heat and anger of that brute. And I never... Oswald, stop. You fought with all your heart and soul. That's all you need ever do. Come then. We have much to prepare for. A bride to wed and a kingdom to lead. But some men wouldn't give for such things. Countless men have died for them. And you, Finir, are you jealous of such things? Hardly. My heart is afire, but my body aches. I desire only a long nap. I saw a bale of hay back there. Later, Abel. For now I must see to the wounded. Then I will see you at the wedding. Aye, of course you will. <laughs> I should return to Elmina. Oswald's wedding will soon begin. Victory was hard won. We did it. Ruin's clan is blown to ash. Press touchpad to open the quest log and draft a new quest. Travel to Elminum. Travel to Elminum. Travel to Elminum, world. Hold cross pass travel. Wedding preparations in full bloom. A beautiful and worthy celebration, my lord. Thank you. May this feast set a spirited tone. Just like you to keep a king waiting at his own wedding.
Yet I arrived in the end. A part of me worried you wouldn't. I gave you my word. I came to see. You look good, Oswald. I gave- I told you I would see you crowned. And now here we are. Without you, I'd be dead. Another wasted hope for East Anglia. You look good, Oswald. Like a man about to marry a more powerful woman. Do I? Because I'm nervous as hell. Of all the battles a man can fight, the war against himself is the hardest to win. I hereby name you man and wife. Miss man and wife, I name you... Oswald of Elmenham, first of his name, the rightful king of East Anglia. With his Lady Valdis, soul, fist, and beauty of this land. You've done it, Stuart. A king now sits on the throne of East Anglia. Don't leave yourself out of this song. We did it together. Back to your dreams, then, of fire and Helheim. I lost my way some time ago. Hard to say when. I don't want to be here. I never did. This was half Dan's dream. He ordered me to see it through. My dreams, I'm sailing, remember? Wind in my beard, salt on my lips. I want that life again. Whether or not I find it, only time will tell. Until then, let us feast, drink, and forget our pain! Eivor! Care for a challenge? Eivor! Wolf kissed. Gaze upon my parts. They stand so strong. Unbreakable at this distance, no? They are not, Brothier. My arrow's shadow would have attacked if they strike. Even after draining so much meat, succeed and you shall be rewarded. I will show you. Keep your eyes open long enough to witness me, you drunken lout. She's 
Everything an easy task for the wolf kissed. Ah, oh, barely a challenge. Impressive, impressive. Here as promised. Now go enjoy the party. <laughs> Skull Ivor, let's have a drink. Your fist is without ale. Let us address that. Surely a special kind of metal is required for drinking before the new king. A metal not unlike your own. To Odin and his endless glories. And the new king of East Anglia. May his reign be long and good. Not bad, Wolf Kiss. I wager you couldn't drink more than me if you tried. <laughs> A fool's wager. A challenge nonetheless. What say you? I will I will drink you under the tape. <laughs> and we'll make it interesting. Put your silver where your mouth is. What say you? Money, I will take your wager. 130. I accept. strong brother <laughs> but I am stronger better luck next time wolf kissed now you owe me some silver fine take it represents fertility. Did you know that? Estos Freyr, what's your point? You impress me, Eivor. Your battle wisdom, your strength of character, skilled in so many ways. Yet I wonder, is there any skill of mine that I could impress upon you? Even a fool has something to teach, whether they're aware of the lesson or not. Hey, hey. But I could show you how to wield my plow sword. Flirt, you want to lay with me? Be plain about it, Stiff Spear. You want to lay with me, is that it? That I do. Will you follow me? To a place more comfortable? Romance Red. A good plow sword is a rare thing. Lead the way.
that's worth a verse or two in some skull song. <laughs> I'll remember that for all time, Eivor. I shall remember too, brother. I shall remember. I shall. I shall. Re I will too, brother. The sagas are never this good. This night remains glorious. These are the moves of Elmenar. So I told the Dane, you get the wool, while the Saxon gets his milk. They'll trade with each other, and when the time comes, we'll make it into a good stew for everyone. You like sheep? I hate it, actually. Hey, when you make hey, that stew, you can have my bottle. You think in such a strange way. for a sweet swine? <laughs> come join me! come on. Saxon God wanders somewhere up here, does he not? I haven't seen him. They like to say he moves with mystery. Look! The moon! It moves on trouble now. But one day it will be eaten by a giant wolf and the nights will be black forevermore. Are you all right? I've tasted glory once again. And it was good. I'm glad to hear it. Now... I always felt like Skull or Hati. Chasing and trying to fulfill Halfdan's wishes. But now I've caught my sun and moon. I've got them and I... I don't know. You can let them go. Sail to a further shore. My longship's in Valhalla. Don't you remember? Fire starter. <gasps> Come on, let's get you to solid ground. Everything's spinny. You're very strong. Y you're very large. This, Eivor. I've had one last glory. I should be happy. I am happy. Thank you. It need not be the last. Not the last. Mm. Mm. 
Enough fun and games. I should see how Oswald is doing. Eivor, I'm about to address our guests, and I'd like you to be there. It has been a worthy ceremony so far. And have you had enough fun yet? I am ready for your address. I am not... I am... I am ready to hear you address your kingdom. Good. Come, come. Join me. Friends, honored guests, we've pushed through hard times. It seems like all we've known is loss. But it is not conflict that binds us. It is compassion. May we always favor compassion, even when our enemies refuse its boon. So to my Dane friends and neighbors, I give thanks for the bravery you have shown during our collective struggles. And for my fellow Christians, may we continue standing as example. I see East Anglia's future right here, right now, in all of you. Still a bit soft on insults, but the king has courage. And to Eivor, without whom none of this would have been possible. On behalf of East Anglia, let this ring be proof of our loyalty to the Raven Clan and all they have done for us today. Would you have any words of wisdom for us? Oswald will be a good king. East Anglia is safe now. I am not one to bask in the glow of another's triumph. But I will say this. East Anglia is safe. Under his protection. Under his guidance. Under his wing. The good King Oswald will keep you safe for many moons to come. To Oswald! Skull! 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 Okay, everyone! Steady all, and ready yourself for the wedding race. The king and his bride against all. My king. He... <laughs> the sheep you left to guard me have been shorn. Oswald, king of sheep fuckers, show your eyes. I challenge you. I accept. Oswald, you can do this. Oswald is king, and a king must have a champion. I will fight in his stead. He challenged me, Eivor. Your fight is bigger than this lord. You must rebuild East Anglia plank by plank, and a dead king cannot keep his oaths. Let me finish this. Oswald, you gutless Arius swine! I'll slay the wolf kissed, then hang you with your own tongue. You always get me in the way! I wish it had not come to this. So much death, so much anger. What is done, is done. You're leaving now? I should. Your wedding should be a day of peace and happiness. Today I lack both. Eivor, you've done East Anglia a great service. I promised you an alliance, and now you have it. And one day I will need you to make good on that alliance. I should find Finnir, say goodbye before I leave. Shadow. 
Valdis, will you not stay a moment longer, Eivor? I should not linger. My banner folk await my return. I understand. Take care, Valdis. You fought well and won yourself a worthy king. I did, didn't I? Take care, Eivor. <laughs> Ah, greetings, Eivor. You're missing the festivities. I've had my fill. It's as much yours as it is Oswald's. I was a crumbling man, Eivor. Before all this, I thought I'd die a tired old failure. But now, my heart burns bright with newfound fire. I want to live hard, die fierce. Glory cares not for age, Finir. Sail with me. My ship could always use a wise head and a strong axe. Together? Together. I'll gather my things. <laughs> A dream come true, like none other. Thank you for everything, from the bottom of my heart. Brother, Oswald is in your hands now. Protect your king, and call out to my banner should the need arise. Aye, Eivor, without a moment's hesitation. Travel safe. I will, friend. Now it seems the wind calls me back to Randy. Best tell her the good news. Brother. Eivor, you will be missed. I gave you a few good memories to keep. <laughs> that you did. Take care of your king, brother. He'll need you in the years to come. World. Not synchronous. Hold cross pass travel. Rowan, Holger, why all this shouting? I could trade that hat for two of your... Eivor, thank Tyr. I heard shouting. Is something wrong? Holger robbed me, and I demand he be punished. Ha! <laughs> Rot disappointed word. Does the deer rub the stream when she takes a drink? Does a cow rub a field when he crops on sweet grass? Eivor, this matter requires sensitive judgment. Will you? Of course. From the beginning, please. Well now, there is no excuse too small, I see. Nothing to keep you from coveting that seat, is there? In Sigurd's absence, who has better claim to oversee these disputes? 
You might leave them to work it out for themselves, but that would mean... letting go, would it not? Please start again. Tell me all that has happened. I will start. I have been falsely accused by this Saxon Philistine. A Philly what? Are you mocking me? Silence, please. I'll hear both of your complaints and render a decision, awarding compensation if needed. Understood? Rowan, I'll hear from you. Rowan, tell me your version of these events. Huh. As you are aware, Holger and I are neighbors. Near enough that I often catch him at my stables, stealing my tools. Borrowing? Holger, let him speak. Stealing, borrowing. My point being, I have always allowed him to use whatever he pleased. I greatly admire your Norse generosity and had hoped to match it. But this morning, Holger stretched the limits of my grace. Entering my stables for their feed, I found my most beautiful, gentle mare stripped of her tail. Bereft, not a strand in sight. I am ashamed to say my natural suspicion drew me to Holger and how right I was. But when I peered across the lane, there he was, gripping a horsetail brush slathered with indigo, dragging it across a sheet of painting, Rowan. I was painting. You make it sound so crude. You see? Such willful arrogance. It will take ages for Ilgafu's tail to reach its former length. I demand compensation. I understand. Thank you, Rowan. Rowan, Holger. Holger, let me hear your sight. Eivor, you have known me as a skald for years. You have seen how my poems bring life and joy and wisdom to our people. And you know that my work requires a certain, let us say, freedom to make use of rare resources to compose my verses. Often, when lacking the proper tools, I have made use of novel items. Alvis's walking stick, Tovi's inks, all were given gladly. You cut off my horse's tail to make a brush, you bleed. Rowan? As I was saying, this morning, in the throes of poetic reverie, I realized that my latest piece required delicate brushwork. I could have used a frayed stick, some cloth, my hands, but no. I needed something gentler, softer. To make a perfect brush, I needed the fine hairs of a well-raised horse. And so I availed myself of a local resource. You clipped Alcafer's tail to the rump without asking. It was early. I did not wish to wake you. Thank you, Holger. I believe I understand your position. Rowan, I'll hear from you. I, I believe I have heard enough. If you will- My horse looks like a fool, Eivor. No handsomer than a donkey now. You must do something. Do not conflate hair with beauty, Rowan. She remains radiant. Elgifer's hair will grow back in no time. Quiet, both of you. Now listen. Rowan is right. Holger, Rowan is clearly in the right. You sheared the tail from his horse without gaining permission. I borrowed the tail! Borrowed! Does the reality of regrowth not make this a victimless crime? It is a two-victim crime, Holger. Though they are unharmed, you took without asking, and that will not do. As the horse's value has diminished significantly, you will pay Rowan its market price. But the horse was not for sale! Rowan! Admit it! My decision is final, Holger. Pay what you owe and meet tomorrow as friends. And if I do, may I keep the horse? Pay the man and be done with it. Rowan, does this satisfy you? It does. Thank you, Eivor. Good. Return to your homes in... Would you allow me to pay you with a vibrant painting? After all, in some ways you helped in its creation. Absolutely. Oh, hello, Eivor. Good day. That Holger, he is quite a character. I almost envy him. To see the world through such a muddy glass and live with such petty concerns. He has no care in the world. Let's not walk too far with that idea. I need you right where you are. East Anglia is with us. Their King Oswald has pledged his loyalty to us. 
Eivor Kingmaker, we shall call you soon. Some interesting news. King Cheolvulv has sent Cheolbert to Shropshire. He hopes to install him as Elderman there. Good for Cheolbert. He should do well considering all he has learned from you. I gave him only a taste of my knowledge. The rest he will need to figure for himself. One more thing. I do not know if you heard, but Svend passed away a short time ago. The poor man slipped away in his bed. I had not heard, no. And how is Tovi? She must be gutted. It has been rough on her. She spends quite a lot of time at his burial mound. Speak with her, if you have the time. Valkas among them. Uh, hey, Eivor! Do you want to die, thief? Eivor, what a pleasure to see you. Oh dear, it feels like it's been so long. Valka, my friend. You're most welcome here. Are you well? Better than well. I am present. And your mother? My mother has found her peace at last. She walks through a world seen only in dreams, and will forevermore. That is all any of us can hope for. Indeed. Come. How was your passage? Accelerating. The waves and the wind were with us from the start. We flew like seabirds. And how are you? In spite of your stoic look, there is a brightness in your eyes that warms me. It may be a kind of hope. A settlement is growing. The people are happy and I am looking forward to more. And your visions? They come and go. But leave all that aside. Let me help you with your things. This way. We found a fine spot for you at the foot of the hill. Hmm. Every hour we traveled, I tried to conjure in my mind some vision of this place. And how close were you? I saw the trees, and the water, and the rolling hill. But I could not foresee so much green. It is a magnificent and calming color. A balm for sea-salted eyes. Where did the other Volka! God, Zerbo, what brings you? Hope there isn't a curse on the settlement or some such. Ha! <laughs> the only curse on this place is their great lout of a blacksmith. It is a rare feeling to travel across the sea and still find oneself at home. This place feels powerful, alive. Do you foresee great things for us? No need for foresight. I feel it in my heart. Is that Valka I see? What took you so long to follow? Wanted to ensure the place was up to snuff. We must talk again soon, Randvi, once I'm settled. And before my arms fall off, what is this I'm carrying? My heaviest reagents, of course. Lead, whalebone, flax of gold. Put this one to honest work. That is what I like to see. All these people you have brought here. This life you have built on these stranger shores. Does it please you? It does. To know that I have built this place and kept these people safe is a gift. You speak first of yourself when I ask this question. Which says more than you intend, I think. Salve, Eivor. Ad Meliora. Good day. And who is that fellow? I have no idea. Well, the town must be bustling. You see there? Your home is just ahead. Tell me about your visions. 
The as they have always been. Little has changed, save their clarity. With every return, the things I see feel less like dreams and more like memories. And does the All Father still appear before you? From time to time, yes. He speaks to me as well, but... It feels mad to say such things aloud. I understand. You can put those just there. Thank you. And here we are. Lovely. Just as you promised. As soon as I am set up here, we can return to the matter of your visions. Valka, please. You are touched, Eivor. A conduit for godly tidings. Please, let me help. I may know a way to clarify these visions. An elixir that may open the door of your mind into the realm of the gods. If you think it would help, I can finish your home myself. Only give me some time. I would be grateful. Thank you, Eivor. Of course. Seer's hut Valka the Seer can help you awaken your th world. In in dreams, Valka needs skills. Fate, let the fate guide your path. All your unspent skill points will be auto signed. Unstoppable will in comp power stroke press L3 the traitor SP boost on the long ship at the cost of stamina. Old cross acquire. Cunning shot performing an R1 alternate shot with any kind of bow will award some adrenaline. Old cross. Roll for. Eye of the North prevents flinching from hits while aiming with your bow. This effect recharges after a few seconds. Old cross. If Combat dive you're immune to all damage while performing a roll, gold cross acquire. Light bow increases your mastery with cunning. Wolf warrior fight with increasing fury as death draws near, your damage increases, survival instinct went. Survival instinct when at less than a third of health, hold right for partial healing, hold cross acquire. Unstoppable well in. Good day, Eivor. Eivor, darling, how nice to see you. Flirt shall romance take her. What about we spend a bit of time? Just you and me. I like how you think. Come over here. Ah, a new letter.
read Selma's letter. Letter from Selma, press circle close, Iver, you entered my mind today, I was thinking about how I felt when I lost Grantbridge, the anger, the doubt, you helped me reclaim my city, but you did more than that, you helped me reclaim what I had lost in myself, today, my people, my city they are stronger than they've ever been, and I am a proud leader once more, Selma.